Brixer Vision here. Hello, everybody, and welcome. Today, I want to talk about the secrets behind not releasing certain skins in the Fortnite item shop, the history behind it, the, the, the logic behind it, and why Epic Games keeps certain skins out of the item shop. Let's go. So as you guys know, there are a lot of Fortnite skins. Now, you guys know that there are also a lot of Fortnite skins that have not been seen in the item shop in quite some time. For example, Skystalker. You guys know, I've said this before, Skystalker has not been in the item shop in a very, very long time. 361 days to be exact. We're also, I'm also talking about Codename Elf. Codename Elf has not been seen in 671 days. Why does Fortnite keep skins out of the shop? Now, there's a few reasons that I believe, and then there's a few reasons that I believe Fortnite believes. Uh, let, let, let's, let's get into it. So, the first thing is to build hype. You guys know this. A lot of people know this about Fortnite cosmetics. You want what you can't have. Let's just be honest. You want the pink Gold Trooper. I know a lot of you guys want that edit style for Gold Trooper because you know that you can't get it. You know that it's impossible to get the pink Gold Trooper. So what does that mean? You want what you can't have. For, for, for Fortnite and Epic Games to keep certain items, certain outfits out of the shop, it will make you want it more. It will make you get excited over its release, over the outfit's release. It's a strategy. It's literally a business move, and they do it all the time. They're doing it without you even knowing, and I just think it's really important, and it's just it's really important for you guys to understand what they're doing and why they do what they do. For example, today, um, December 2nd, 2019, Nagops and Yuletai Ranger re-released in the Fortnite item shop. Now you're probably thinking, okay, Brickster, like that's cool, but like it's not really that big of a deal if you're like me and you bought it last year. But it is though, because Nagops and Yuletai Ranger have not been seen in the Fortnite item shop in 323 days. That's a long time of a skin not being in a shop. We know that most likely almost all of the holiday themed outfits that come out in Fortnite won't re-release until that next holiday rolls back around. Now if you miss that skin, you know that you gotta wait an entire year in order to own that skin again. For example, my situation is Sugar Plum. I didn't buy it last Christmas, which means I gotta wait until the next Christmas, which is this Christmas. Same exact thing with Nagops. I have a friend that was dying for Codename Elf. What happened? Epic Games didn't release it in over 320 days. The hype became big for some people. I really want Nagops. I really want it. I didn't buy it last year. I'm so excited to own it. Oh my gosh, is it gonna come back? Is it gonna come back? And and they drop it back in the item shop over 300 days of not being in the shop and the people who missed it last year are excited and want to buy it oh my gosh it's only 800 v-bucks i'm so excited and the cycle goes on and on and on and to be honest with you guys it is such a smart business move that some of you guys might not even know that they're doing it right now there are skins that came out during halloween that they are doing that right now there are so many fort nightmare skins that came out this year that they're literally i'm literally googling it right now as we're doing it fort nightmares 2019 guys there's literally outfits that they released during Fort Nightmares in October that I'm telling you right now, they're doing the exact same thing. They are not going to release these outfits until next Fort Nightmares. So the people who missed it this year are going to have to wait until next year. The hype's going to grow. People are going to want it and they're going to make bank. They did the exact thing, same thing with Gold Trooper, Skull Trooper. They're about to do it to Codename Elf. Um, and it's just literally a business practice. So another thing I also want to speak to everybody about is edit styles, OG styles. Gold Trooper has the OG pink edit style. Skull Trooper has the OG purple edit style. Those styles are for the original owners of the outfits. Now, something really interesting that I truly believe is 
I truly believe that eventually those those styles will be either given to people who already own it or they're going to be sold in the item shop. Now, let me explain to you why I believe this. Not now. This is going to be very, very far down the road. But there is a tiny bit of hype for some people for the edit styles. Purple skull, pink gold. Why? Because you know you can't have it. You know it's impossible to get that style. Which means Fortnite has something Fortnite has something that they know that you can never have. And they know that if they ever bring that back, you're going to freak out. You're going to want it. You're going to want that pink style. And it's a way for Epic Games to say, like, like we know that you like this skin, but you we, all, we also know that you want this. It, it, it's, it's, a, it's a really interesting thing. So that's just what I want to talk to you guys about. It's, it's really important that you know... That if you see a holiday skin that you really like and you have the money for it, buy it. Because if you don't buy it, you might be waiting a year for it. I don't know if they're going to hold back on any more cosmetics anymore. I think it was a one-time thing with Gold Trooper and Codename Elf. I don't know if they're going to hold back anymore. Um, I, I just really don't think that they're going to do it. I think it's over. I think everybody has really come to the point where we all know that holiday skins don't come back until the next holiday most likely so yeah thank you for watching you are beautiful you are amazing you're awesome don't forget to smile because you're all beautiful people have a wonderful day bo 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 brixer vision